Good morning, my dear students. Now today I am going to start uh, some alphabetical patterns. Now in your book it is given on the page number 333. First question today it is 25. Number question in which we have to print the pattern. Alphabet. Alphabets pattern. So how it will be? So basically we have to start it from A. So this is very clear that we have to accept one variable with A. CH is equal to I have taken A in capital. Now for I in range 0 to let's an example 7 I am giving and in this for j in for j in range 0 comma i plus 1 I have given Now in this, I am going to print ch, comma, and without line change, and here I am incrementing the value ch plus plus. Now print blank. Now here you can see, now here we have to increment this ch, so we will take this chr and ord, chr is used to change it in character and ord is used to change it in number, so I will change the ch in number and then I will add 1 and then again I will change it in character and then I will update the value of ch. So here if I am giving a space here so you can see this is the output. Now to reduce the value to 5 now you can see a b c d e f like this this pattern is going on. So how we have done this? This is done with the function chr. It is used to change the ASCII code in character value, and ORD is used to change the uh, number only uh, with this uh, ASCII code which you have given. Now, this was the first program. Now, make it as comment and move to the next. Now, the next program this is. 25 question number B this is also alphabet pattern now again here CH is equal to I am considering A and then for I in in range this is 0 to 5 for j in in range 0 comma i plus 1 now here if I am simply removing this and I am pasting it here then I am printing the ch with end is equal to one space and I am updating the value of ch like as uh, upside I have done control c control v 
and then print this save and this you can see a a b a b c a b c d a b c d e as in earlier it was increasing and uh, now it is again and again as it is starting from the same value now with a small change again you can do some changes always you have to maintain the indentation otherwise it will create a problem now if it i have given here here then you can see simply it is a a a a coming so this value which we have given here and there that we have to manage for the particular output now this question is over now make it as comment and come to the next question this is 25c again 25c this is number pattern this number pattern in this 0 to 2 4 4 4 like this it is coming so a is equal to 0 i have taken for i in in range in this 1 2 3 4 5 rows are there so 0 comma 5 i will run this loop for j in range 0 comma i plus 1 and here it should be colon not the semicolon now here we have to print the value of a comma end is equal to here give the space and increment the value of by 2 then print so control s and f5 so you can see 0 2 4 6 8 10 like this it is going on it is increasing like and if you slightly change the position of this then the output will vary control v here control s and f5 so you can see 0 0 2 0 2 4 like this it is going on now come to the next question now as you will turn the page question number 26 on 334 page you have to print the empty uh, uh, square with the triangles this question I have given you also yesterday I have discussed this question now we have to write uh, now question number 27 in this three number we have to input and we have to print it in increasing order so how we will do this question that I am going to show you three values are a b c now a is equal to int input enter the first number now same thing I am going to copy so this is second third and this is C now we have to check the condition if A is greater than B and A is greater than C and if 
b is greater than then c then max comma min mid comma min is equal to max is a comma b comma c else troll g max c b If L if B is greater than C and B is greater than A and if C is greater than A then b c a b comma a comma c L if C is greater than A and C is greater than B if A is greater than B then C A B and c b a c b a print max comma mid comma min 12 10 15 so you can see it is in decreasing order, no problem. Min for reversing the output means minimum and then mid then max. I have just interchanged these variables. Now when you will run this program 12, 10, and 15. So you can see 10, 12, and 15 is coming. So this is the desired output, and this is the question number 27. Now make this question as comment. Now students, in question number 28, in this question, temperature con conversion, in this question it is asked that uh, first input the temperature and uh, we have to ask the user's choice what they want so print enter your choice Enter your choice, print, 
वन डॉट एफ फॉरन हाइट एंड प्रिंट टू फॉर डिग्री डिग्री सेल्सियस नाउ हेयर वी हैव टू टेक द नंबर सो एन इज इक्वल टू इंट इनपुट enter the this message is not needed because already we have just shown the message now here if if n is equal equal 1 so what we have to do for foreign height we have to give the message print enter temperature in degree celsius now f is equal to we have to give the formula 9 upon 5 in bracket 9 upon 5 multiply the value enter the degree celsius that we have to accept so c is equal to int input now here c and then Plus thirty-two, and then print temperature in is F. L if n is equal equal to we have to print the same messages but we have to change this in foreign height. then we have to take the value of f and then this should be c here this relation will be changed and this is is equal to 5 by 9 5/9 and f into this is the value of f Into thirty-two. Here we have to print the value degree Celsius is C. And now else we have to give print. please enter valid choice now here it is showing one for fahrenheit and two for degree so i am giving one now it is enter the temperature in degrees celsius so i am giving degrees 45 so in fahrenheit it is 113 
now if again we are running this program and this time I'm giving 2 then enter the temperature in Fahrenheit I'm giving 99 so in degree Celsius this is calculating like this now if I am running this program again and I am giving the value 3 or 6 please enter valid choice so this program is working properly make this as comment thank you students for today note down these programs in your copy and maintain the notes thank you